Hey, what's going on, you guys? This is Madam, and I'm coming back to you once again. Uh, this time, we're going to go over to the U.S. Sun. And uh, it seems like everybody's using the same playbook. And this is in the crime section. It says, ex Abercrombie CEO Mike Jeffries arrested in ST investigation over abuse of young men at Silbert parties. I will list the article right in all of the details in the description, as I always do. But the article starts off by saying the former CEO of Abercrombie and Finch have reportedly been arrested after he was investigated for ST. Mike Jeffries has been accused of coercing young men into having intimate relations with him or each other at parties thrown at an all-American fashion brand. Mm-mm. Jeffries, his partner Matt Smith, and a third man, J- uh, Jim Jacobson, were arrested on Thursday after a federal investigation was launched in, uh, launched in January, sources told ABC News. The investigation came over one year um, after 100 alleged victims filed a civil suit against Jeffries, accusing him of running a CDST scheme using Abercrombie's name. Lawyer Brad Edwards, who is representing the accusers, said the alleged scheme uh, permeated throughout the company and allowed the three individuals arrested today to victimize dozens and dozens of young aspiring male models. Jeffries came under fire after the BBC published an investigation where several former models came forward with disturbing tales of performing uh, intimate acts or favors in hopes they could be an Abercrombie model. Between the 1990s and the early 2000s, young men were allegedly scouted by the middleman who groomed them by performing an intimate act or asking them to perform an intimate act of him. Then the hopeful models would attend perverse Abercrombie parties where they would be enticed to have intimate relations with Jeffries Smith or each other, they told the BBC. One man said at the party he remembers having a drink after Jeffries tried to kiss him before he blacked out. The next morning, he woke up and found a condom uh, inserted in a place that shouldn't have been. Okay? When I put things together, I believe there's there is a very good possibility I was drugged and art, he told the BBC. I probably never, never knew, uh, know for sure the answer of what happened. And that is the end of the article right there. Uh, shocking, but not surprised. Um, it just seems like uh, Jeffries in you know, all of these people in these positions of power and uh, prestige are definitely using the same handbook. And uh, <laughs> the quote, Cat Williams, all lies will be exposed. Okay? You know, I mean, that's basically what's going on. And just to think about, you know, People just trying to get their foot in the door, whether it be through the music industry, whether it be through fashion, whether it be corporate, whether it be any type of industry to know that they have to, you know, demoralize themselves just to become part of a brand, part of, a, you know, an industry which, you know, if you are fortunate enough to make it in these industries, it could be very promising and very lucrative for you. However, sometimes some of the things that these people have to do, um, it goes back to that old phrase, sleeping your way to the top. Uh, it, it, it takes on a whole new meaning for me because it doesn't necessarily mean that you willingly did that. Um, in some cases, which we are finding out, um, you know, and we haven't even made it to like we are only like two months away from the new year. I can just imagine all the sorted 
you know, scandalous things that are going to come out between now and then. So, yeah, this is another one. Uh, you know, nobody is safe. <laughs> okay? Pretty much. And I think that's the thing, you know. Whether it be they're not safe because it has to be a fall guy. Or no one's safe because the law of karma is actually making its rounds. I don't know. What do you think? Drop down in the comment section. Come chop it up with me. You know I love to hear from you. Don't forget to uh, like, subscribe, and share. And with that, thank you so much. I do appreciate you watching my video. And I will get with you guys in the next one.